Well, hello everybody, welcome back to Kingdoms and Castles. We are going to be building out the farming area in this video, which is pretty much all done. I want to add some more of the orchards, but we need a few more people. We're, um, we're filling out pretty well. We had, in the last episode, took out all the industry inside of the base, and we're currently taking out these rocks, but replacing everything with as much housing as possible. We currently have 125 people idle with a population of 690 and we need to create a couple more beds because we definitely have a growing population. Now, there are two methods we could do uh, for this. One would be to probably ex uh, expand this lower part here. The reason I want to do that is because I have a church and several other desirability buildings that would fill this area out just a little bit better. So let me think for a moment about how we can best achieve this. Um, we would need to move some of these industries, primarily all this wood. I think potentially moving all the wood cutting to the east might be a good idea. That way we can actually just kind of fill this whole southern area out. With even more housing, we have one large aqueduct, which is um, a large reservoir. I'm sorry, with aqueducts going into a big bathhouse here but this is going to provide more than enough uh, room for farming so as you can see we have a pretty sizable intake of food but oh, we just need to keep going we got our archers we got multiple uh, masons repairing structures giant ass ballista towers and uh, pretty much everything else that you need to ensure that any dragons and raids are pretty much dealt with immediately. So let's let's get to it. Let's get to the reorganization stage. I, two I should have two bakers over here, I believe. Um, let's see what let's see what we got going on. We have granaries. We have fish production. I didn't get to creating the bakers yet. Okay, that's good to know. Now bakers do give desirability bonus and it would have been nice to have had that in that area but i just don't know if that's going to be possible so i am just going to place them right as they are right there Ooh, that was a fast spin we got a little bit of fire we do have a um fire brigade within this design so that should be taken care of pretty quickly here now this is going to be difficult um and not difficult i think probably what we should do is kind of shift production like i said a little bit to the east so let us get some roadage down here. And we do have the capacity to make stone roads, so we definitely should. Um, let's just do it. Just get the whole dang thing out there. All right, cool. So, oh, that's the castles. We got lots of gardens. We got lots of, ooh, a jousting arena would be pretty dope. Now, there's a lot of, uh, there's a lot of stuff in this game, to be quite honest. You can build some pretty, some pretty big cities. So, we're going to, yeah, we're going to need to move the coal maker over here. I'm just going to uh, have this side uh, pulled out. This is all still going to be outside, so I really don't have to do too much moving over here. I just need to um, get the the foresters back up, and you have to have trees near the foresters for them to go up. That can be kind of a little pain in the ass, but. Uh, there's two foresters there. So that will allow me to demolish that forester and demolish this forester. And then I'm going to carpet clean this entire area here. We're going to make this very fresh and clean. Demolish that because we got one over there. We're also going to demolish this well. And let me look to see what we got going on here. We want a well into design, so put the well over there. Alright, let's get rid of the road on this side. And... Oof. I get rid of all of this. We're, I know we're going to leave ourselves a little exposed, but I'm okay with that, personally. Um... Let's just try to get this all hammered out. And I'm just going to have this part of the base go down as far as it pretty much can, which I think is right about here. And then we'll have that. 
that. And I want this to be double wide. Um, so, man, that is a lot of stone. Yeah, we're gonna have, we're definitely gonna have this be as defensible as possible. We can do moats, that's pretty neat. Um, guess I can get rid of all the land here. Except right here is gonna be a little weird because it's a corner piece. Um, I think actually we can build a pier. Um, yeah, a pier. We can do a pier and uh, bump this part a little up right there, which we should definitely do. Want the wall to be all symmetric and stuff. So, all right, there we go. All right, we got a lot of people out here doing the Lord's work, building me uh, an empire. We'll need to get defenses up for sure, though. Um, yeah, we got one of the giant stone mines, but I wasn't able to do it um, over here, unfortunately. Without, yeah, it's just what we have to remove a little bit more stone to do it. And let's see what we got going on. So let's get rid of this rock. Cause that thing's just blocking the whole dang, whole dang path. And let's get the stone road there. And all the stone there. It's kind of crazy how many freaking people there are in this design. Uh, yeah, we'll get a, a road in here and we'll build another residential area. That's going to be pretty awesome. I'm figuring we can use these, uh, side, these side tiles for any kind of mason and little, you know, taverns and all types of stuff. Same thing over here. I got the little side tile thing going. Probably one thing that we should do is try to... Um, I guess we don't... It doesn't matter where the market is placed. Hmm. I kind of want to put the market right here. That's kind of a neat little indent spot. I'm just going to leave it that way. And... Um, great library. Increases maximum knowledge, cathedral, jousting arena, theater. Oh man, these are all really cool buildings. I, I want to get one of those in my design. Nice. Hmm. Looks like they're having a hard time getting to this. Are they building it through the... The wall? I don't know how they're doing it. Let's speed this up a bit. Ah, we got a rock. We definitely need to get rid of that rock. Okay, cool. Alright, cool. We got all of our buildings back up, and I think that's going to be more than enough for wood. And we're going to have a really cool little defensive area here. Okay, now a really good defense, I think, probably would be right around um, this part here. Get that area raised. We're going to raise this as high as possible and put you know, towers and everything on it. We're going to get raided here in a couple of years, so. Alright, cool. We got rid of the weak link. Ballistas up there. Get another tower up there. Cool, cool. They're able to get in there. Get that up. That'll be great. We're about to get raided, so this isn't optimal, but... Alright, cool. I think that's actually kind of high enough. I know I can go higher, but it's like at some point you just kind of... Okay, that's good. It looks, I mean, like, it kind of looks ugly when they're, like, that crazy high. Like, I like it to just be kind of modest height. Just kind of looks, I think it looks a little bit more authentic. There we go. Get that up a little bit. Vikings. 
All right, here come the Vikings. Ooh, Nito. Yeah, definitely need to get uh, defenses over here. Oh shit. I think they just blew up a piece of land. Nice, that's pretty cool. Yeah, we don't have any defenses over here at the moment, but uh, we do have quite a bit. Other defenses all around. Repairing's easy. Oh, crap. Alright, let's get these guys over here. Once we, yeah, once we get, like, basic defenses on the left side, this won't be a problem. But we need to get rid of that catapult. Oh, cool, we can attack the ships, too. What the hell did that... Is that a big dude? Yeah. Alright, well... That was kind of rude, but, uh, I feel like we did pretty well there. Alright, now that we got that, I think we can get the castle up. Yeah, it's pretty obvious to me that we want to get this area up. We'll do the same thing over there with the ballista and an arrow tower. My god, what is going on? Oh, he's he's having fun over there. At my expense, cool. Where the hell are my archers? Alright, um... There they are. Alright, cool. Ballista finally came into to being. But luckily, I found that button that just kind of takes everything. Realistically, it's, it feels like I need to uh, pay a little bit more attention to these areas. Alright, cool. There we go. Alright. And then once we can get a little bit more stone... Oh, shit, we got a dragon. Right, we got dragons coming now. We got a lot of ballistas now, though. I feel like we're going to be able to take this thing out pretty quick. A lot of ballistas, a lot of arrows going. Damn, dude, that thing is wrecked. There's a lot of them. Yeah, that guy got away. Very good. We got one of the dragons. Okay, cool. So that wasn't that bad. Um, I mean, we're, we're just going to get more and more powerful, so. And I want to make sure that I'm building these things out pretty well, so. Let's get some roads. Let's just use normal roads for now. I want to put something here like a jousting arena or or something. I think we need another nice, cool building. We got the baths, and that's gonna make this area over here happy. Everybody's really, everyone's doing actually pretty well. They're pretty happy right now. Um, let's just keep making sure that we're throwing festivals and stuff just to keep that up at 100. I think that's high enough. It's definitely, like, pretty crazy. I don't know if we should do Greek fire or not. Um, it does look pretty dope, but I don't know if it's that great. Um, Alright, so we got defenses there, defenses there. Um, I don't really know if any more defenses are going to do us too much. Um, I do think, though, that we probably need, like, another ballista. 
for these dragons and for the bigger dudes. Like right there, I think that'd be a great spot for another ballista. And it looks like no charcoal available. Well, that's just crazy because we have a big dude right here. How is that even possible? I don't know how that's possible. Wood sufficient? Do I need to make another one of them? Wow. Okay. I don't know. It's kind of weird. Charcoal's like really... I had like an insane amount of charcoal at one point. Alright, let's just make sure we got roads. Hopefully the fire brigade gets over there soon. Alright, cool. So they don't got charcoal. They'll, they'll get charcoal. They're just being difficult. There we go. Let's get this road all situated. Cool. Definitely coming along now. I don't know, really know if there needs to be anything down here, but I kind of feel like you should have probably something. Shit. <laughs> There we go. Build up them walls. Yeah, I feel like we have to have something for the ships, so... Perfect. I think what we'll probably end up putting here are... Hmm. These things are kind of expensive, is the thing. You don't want to go too crazy with it, because I could run out of money. 12 gold per year, 6 gold per year, so yeah, it's like, if you do something, you kind of want to keep it cheap. But is it going to, yeah, it's going to be able to defend that wall, it's going to be able to defend over here, so we'll do it. Okay, cool. Two little archer towers there. Perfect. Little bit of a defensive barrier probably is a good idea. Perfect. Alright, I think we're in good shape now. It's looking nice. Looking defensible. Um, so we got the market up. How's that doing? Cool. Cool, cool. Uh, I think our next goal is joust oh man look how big that is it can fit right here but it doesn't look like it looks like right here would be the best place for it hmm I really want this jousting arena I'm not gonna lie the theater might be better though look at the theater radius yeah, a theater right here would be would actually make a lot more sense. Probably should have put it one tile over there, but that's fine. Um, I think we're gonna have to say no to jousting, um, and I want to keep everything here kind of on the, the level. So I think right here would be a fantastic place for a large tavern and some more religious buildings. Let's look at everything we got going on here. Um, library for sure. Hospital, we can do another clinic. And we can do oh we can do a church right there. We should definitely do a church with the hell did I okay cool. And then enough room for um eight more manors. That's really gonna push our population where it needs to go. We have sixteen hundred food, we have just enough money coming in, plus sixty-two. Cool. So we didn't overdo it with the uh the new towers. That's great. Cool, we got the fishing guys doing their thing, we got the bread people doing their thing, everybody's everybody's doing a good job. Nice. 
Heck yeah, hospital. Ooh. All right, and there's the Vikings. Always coming to ruin my day. I think they're gonna come from uh, mostly the south this time. So let's let's keep our guys on uh, alert. Probably over here. Yeah. Now now these ships are gonna have a hard time getting in. Hmm. It'd be cool to sink some ships. All right, we got uh, we got a lot of people moving in. Looks like they got a lot of siege equipment. Nice. I really want to see if we can sink one of these boats. That'd be pretty neat. Oh shit! Yeah, we got our archers helping out. They're gonna melt melt these units pretty pretty quickly. Send out the archers. Take care of this. Oh shit. They're all over. Nice. That's cool. If I click attack, they'll go out and attack and then they'll come back. So that's really cool. So I don't have to sit there and micromanage all that. Alright, yeah, these these dang raiders, man. Alright, that was a pretty uh easy raid. Theater should help quite a bit. Um, let's get the those taxes coming in. I don't even know if I want to do roads down here, but I guess I will. That might be something we need to do. Just make sure we got wells over here. Well, I need to make sure we got water. Yeah, it looks like everywhere else has got, got wells going on. I don't think I had any wells over here though, and that actually might be a problem. Mm, put one back there, put one outside there. Well, it looks like we'll have enough water after all that's built. Great, dragon. Yay. Alright, um I need some dragon killing like dragon killing towers to be honest. Whoa. A lot of sounds going off. All right, well, it looks like we are able to kill dragons fairly easy, actually. That's pretty awesome. Nice. So we don't need dragon killing towers. <laughs> Got enough. Hmm. I thought I had at one point more towers over here. I could have sworn I had more towers. Um. Alright, let's do Greek fire. Oh no, look, Greek fire's not that big. It's probably really cool, but I'm gonna put another ballista. That makes me feel a little bit better. I've got plenty of ballistas now and plenty of uh, archer towers everywhere. And a massive population. It looks like coal's kind of not doing us too hot. And it looks like wood's going down really fast. So I better get ahead of that. Let's um, probably need another mason too. Forester, let's just get another guy up there. Another guy up right there. Probably gonna need to go a little crazy with the foresters, to be honest. We're having the coal problems already. It'd 
We definitely have the workforce for it. Oh man, I kind of do... Oh, I'm not going to be able to do it. I really want to get to a thousand people. I don't think... Yeah, these are... Because these are only... This is only going to be another hundred. Yeah, we're so close. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know if it's gonna happen that way I'm thinking it's gonna happen. Oh, I could actually put cottages and stuff right there. Oh, cool. I didn't realize there's a one-tile gap between these guys. Yeah. Could, could feasibly put cottages in between. And then I could put cottages all along the sides right there. Yeah, we're going to be able to do it. Very nice. One thousand pop, here we come. There's definitely enough well water everywhere, so cool. Alright, that should do it. That should be a thousand right there, easy. And we got more room to build houses if it's not. Uh, the main thing now is that we're going to need to get a second coal maker up. I kind of feel like my coal production is a little absurd right now, to be honest, though. But for some reason, that's not enough. Alright, we just need to get another 75. Come on. <laughs> insufficient. Insufficient. Come on. One day. Hmm. Probably got the bill right here. Once they get that thing done, then I can put the second coal guy right there. And we'll have enough coal for everybody. Yeah, we got a thousand nineteen beds now. We're we're more than we're more than okay. Oh. These things are huge though. I mean they take freaking fifteen workers. Alright, so that should we definitely got the wood coming in now from all these guys. Yeah, we're doing good. Look how many tools and freaking armaments we have are like way awesome there. Let's make sure that we keep uh, holding festivals, like I said, to keep people happy. Thought that the, thought that the freaking theater would do a good job, but hospital. Yeah, I mean, I think we're taking good care of people. How much money do we have coming in? Thirty-three. I can't lower the taxes, so yeah, we're doing awesome. get all of these roads to stone. There shouldn't be any road that is not stone at this point. It's pretty nuts, actually. When you look at everything, and this is just a little part of the map. I like could, in theory, continuously expand. Um, I could even build another little city on the other side. Oh, ooh. yeah, thousands eighty-one pop. They're a little harder to um, make happy, though. Let's see what's. Let's see what they want. They want um, plague infection. So, but our healthcare is pretty good churches. They want more churches. That's actually pretty easy. Yeah, churches are two by two. Um, churches and libraries are full. Well, libraries are easy, but they're expensive. And you can see the radius of everything, so I could put a library over here. And I can put a chapel right there. That might help. Yeah, it's gonna cost me some money though. Plus seventy, yeah. That's like we're we're just in the green, so twenty-one out of twenty-four. 
I need to tell these guys to recuperate. Oh, we got a ton of people coming in. Great. Alright. Yeah, these big guys are pretty scary, but they're also easy to kill when you have a lot of ballistas like I do. Everyone else just gets melted. Yeah, that wasn't very scary. Alright, now we got cold creeping back up. A few armies coming in from the northeast. A few armies that have not decided where they want to land. We got 21 ships in the area. Very nice. And the masons are really kind of pissing me off. There's a lot of buildings that are still needing repair. I think we're going to have to build more masons. We built two. They're pretty expensive, though. Um, six gold per year. They're not that expensive, my bad. <laughs> they want to come back here and break my shit again. What the hell? That's cool. Where? Oh, wow. This ship's just kind of chilling. Uh, looks like it got stuck or something. Where's my second army, though? I only see one. Weird. I wonder if it died or something. Alright, we're gonna train another archer squad. Alright. That was interesting. Uh, the city's getting pretty damn big, though. Um, our food... Our food is dipping under a thou. So that leads me to believe we are not sufficient. A couple more orchards ought to do some good there, but... Um... Hmm. Alright, let's think about this. I don't have any roads going this way. And I can't have any roads. Can, two, three, I could technically have a road right there. Ooh, humble kingdom. We just got to one thou. Right when the dragons come. Yeah, now, the, now that we have so many ballistas, these dragons don't stand a chance, to be honest. Archer squad over there. Oh, we lost the person. We're at 999. All right. There we go. Let's get a couple more little farms up. That will help with the food supply. I think that will... Yeah, now we're going over a thousand. I just want to make sure that we don't uh, have food issues. I should probably even make more, more bread. Because these guys turn um, one of these and one coal into five bread. So it's like you really want to have a uh, force multiplier. You go crazy with bread. Let's just do that. We have 207 idle workers. We could definitely afford them. I don't know if they cost money per... Okay, yeah, cool. And they don't even take that many workers. Only three. There we go. Got the bread. I need to move the cemetery. So let's... Let's actually do that. Ooh, we can do a siege workshop. Military siege equipment. I want that, man. That sounds dope. Let's build that... Um, here. And then we can get road out this way. And then from there we can wall this in. Small gate. Don't 
be able to get outside, but yeah. Just keep walling this area in. I'm actually going to uh, put a defensive position here. Protect all of my investment. Cool, we got more masons now, so things should be repaired faster. We got, ooh, food is not, uh, food is going down. But we should, we should be pretty good. I need to move this. I kind of want to wall this area in now, because I can wall it off to the water right here. Keep the invading forces from being able to get in there. We got plenty of time, though. We can do all of those things. I want to get siege equipment up, though. That sounds badass. Shit, people don't have houses? What's going on? I have more people. Oh, crap. Well, that's... that's not my fault. I didn't tell them to come here. Unless... Oh, a house broke. Okay. I guess that's my fault. Get that house back up, and then we'll be on uh, the up and up. 71 gold. Food is good. Alright, cool. Now we can move this stupid graveyard. Um, What the hell was graveyards again? Uh, here we go. Cemetery. I'm going to put the cemetery dude over here. At the very end of all of this. And then um, you can do all types of cool stuff. I like the diamond cemetery. I like this. I think this looks kind of crazy. Let's build all that up. Destroy the cemetery. Yeah, I know. We just destroyed a lot of, a lot of graves and stuff. So people are going to be potentially upset about that or not. They don't seem very upset about it. well and then this all up looks like we can double gate that okay and then we'll get another little defensive area up here I'll probably do a better job at this one. I'll probably do two archer towers and a ballista because this is going to be getting a lot of attention over here. But yeah, we can, I mean, like, basically we just sealed this whole area unless they land here. But even if they land over here, we have a ton of things that can shoot into this area. So we don't really need defenses there. We pretty much just sealed off this whole island. People are being kind of crabby. Oh, the recent departed. And yeah, this is only negative. They're only a little bit upset about that. Taverns. They want more taverns. They they're more upset that there aren't places to get drunk than me just shelving all the dead people. That's it tells you quite a bit. About priorities. So let's build two taverns. All right, cool. They were unhappy. There was nowhere to bury the dead, and now they're happy because. I made it. See, look, I made it better. It's prettier. Big old graveyard. Mm, food is kind of scaring me. Hmm. Yeah. That will have to be done. We need to continuously expand our empire. Guess, guess in theory we could keep going off in this direction. There we go. A couple more farms. Alright, cool. Oh, we're getting back up another thousand. Oh, and here come the Vikings on cue. Oh, 
Oh, it looks like it. F oh, I see. I think I think it's got wood underneath it, and that's why it's collapsing. Silly me. This is going to be a little beefy defensive area down here. What in the hell is going on? Everything's doing great. All our resources are finally stabilizing. The people are getting a little bit happier. I need about recent plague infection. There's nothing really I can do about that. I think I have like a pretty good infrastructure of hospitals that respond to that, so that that'll be resolved just with time itself. Oh shit! Oh, I didn't realize they could float through the ocean like that. That's interesting. All right. Well, they're—I mean—they're getting eaten up by running into these fields, so that's not really smart on their part. All right. Cool. On these defenses. Oh, shit. It does look like they are destroying my archer squads. Let's build catapults, too. I'm gonna have to wait. Um... I got catapults now, too. That's pretty dope. Yeah, once we get the ballista and stuff out here, that ballista's just gonna own. I'm gonna put him over here. Put them back here for now. Alright. Well, that wasn't too difficult. Okay. We get ballistas and towers up in no time. Plus seven gold, oof. That's not good. I'm gonna have to increase tax rates to 30%. Or I'm gonna have to build out more population. Yes, plus 16 gold ain't gonna cut it for these new defenses that I need. We did lose some people, though, uh, once I get my popular... Oh, there we go. I think that's what it was. Now, now that we got those people back, I could probably hold it. You gotta raise the uh, towers around them so you can raise these. Oh, shit. Perfect. Alright, that's about as tall as I want it. Otherwise, it just gets too, like, freaky looking. There we go. That's all the defenses I really need right there. That will take these that ballista will take out any catapult. Yeah, any catapult I guess is gonna get wiped out. Honestly, I think I think this army right here is costing me a fortune. Yeah. Went to say, yeah, the um, the siege camp. I don't think it's worth it. It's the the gold cost on that, and I, I don't want to raise it. That was like thirty gold. I want to keep my tax rate down. Um, I want to keep my people happy and productive. Just keep doing festivals. Mm, they're filling the graveyard fast. Uh, 
There you go. That's pretty dope. Yeah, we got um, Ballista, Archer Tower. So if they do try to do their little waddle around, we got two Archer Towers shooting down, and we got two Archers shooting. You guys wigging out. Driving me crazy. We also got, you know, our giant anti anti dragon ballistas in the back here. And we got multiple, we got multiple ballista from pretty much every point in the space. Dang, dude, our cult production is a little too crazy. I'm gonna delete one of these. Yeah, finally, cold production finally caught up. Ooh, that's not good too. I think um, our storage is probably gonna get full. Crap. There we go. I built two of them. Stock. I mean, they take a bit of workers, nine workers, but we have. I'm pretty sure that these things are full. 990, yeah. Okay, we probably need to cut down on uh, some wood. We're finally catching up resource wise, so I'll just adjust it a little bit by little until we're at a point where, like, we're. Like, I like to have gro like consistent growth, but not like 25%. Like, I, I want, like, every year to have a hundred more wood than the last year. Like, that's a more manageable growth than, you know, every year having a thousand more wood. Because um, these things only hold 990. So. And they, they're they they're expensive. They take people. I mean, I do have the people, though, to spare, but uh, I don't want to use them that way. Boom, 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 boom. Food. I feel like we should have enough food, but... Yeah, I know with the bread makers going, like we're, we should be just producing insane 18 loaves of bread ready to be picked up by heads of household. Ah. So these do kind of like need to be in, in the area. Or a market. Hmm. I don't know if having this this many is actually worth it because they're not um yeah i think that they need to be localized to be to be useful and i don't really have any place places for them Oof. i'm gonna build two granaries instead We got a flood of food coming in now. But I'm still a little afraid that our food production um, is falling behind. Get a little bit more orchards. Yeah, we're, we're doing we're doing it. Wood is like way overkill right now. I think like coal looks pretty good to me. I mean, ar armaments and everything else looks pretty good to me. How many blacksmiths do I have in this design? Four. All right, we could probably get rid of one of the blacksmiths. Start cutting down on all of the uh, unnecessary things. Wood's growing. Like slightly, it was like 1500 last year, it's 1600, it's like right where I want it to be. Okay, cool. We're yielding, we're yielding pretty well, but um... Just need to keep food production up. That should do it. All right, Vikings are coming. We got 
three three bands of archers. I think that's pretty good for our financial situation. I think having a really tall ballista is better than um, building off ballistas that I can move to. Ooh, festivals are more expensive when you have this many people. Or I think it could just be a cooldown. They were 100 before. Alright, so they're landing in the northern section. Holy shit, they brought friends. 25. Alright. Alright. Well, they got a lot to get through, though. Yeah, the bliss is not really good against the small units. But yeah, these guys didn't stand a chance. Oh, and they're just running right by. That's pretty dumb. That's pretty funny, though. That's cool, though, that the archers follow. I like the AI for sure. It's, it's a lot smarter than it used to be, I think. Yeah, they didn't barely do any damage. That's pretty, that's pretty nuts. Nothing, nothing bad really happened. I don't think they broke anything. Cool. I think our food situation is finally like at a really good spot. Um, looks like, like we're doing pretty good. Yeah, keep, keep saying 18 lows ready to be picked up and no one's coming. I, I do think that I could uh, potentially just be wasting my time with them there. Probably need to put them uh, down here. Got a hobble there. Oh, I keep forgetting I can pay money to the church. Now we'll also get happiness up. There's a lot of ways to get happiness up in this. Nice. Ooh, medicine's not good. Um, let's get another clinic up. That will cost some money, but, uh... Alright, we got dragons approaching from the south. Yeah, there's some hissy-looking dragons. Look how fast we eat them up now, though. They don't even barely get a shot off. Boom, you're going down. Oh, wow, he got away with a few HP. Yeah, the dragons are pretty ruthless. They they actually do good damage. Got one of the towers. But uh, they're no match. They are no match for this new town. This guy's talking about the cemetery, but there's plenty of room. Cool. Okay, we're back over a thousand food. That's where I want to be. 1700 wood, so cool. We're growing at 700 wood. Coal, we're gro growing. Coal's like staying pretty neutral, and then everything down here is kind of staying a little high. And we'll have to watch the iron intake. We might have to pull back on that a bit, or or we'll have to create another town. Like, you could do, we could do it anywhere, really. Um, my preference is always to kind of expand what I already got. Realistically, you just build around any of this kind of stuff, but industry, you don't really want around residents. Yeah, we're doing great. Alright, well that's where I'm going to leave this episode. Thank you so much for watching. <laughs>